Hey, how you doing? We're going to work on the fuse here. It's going to go pretty fast. I sped this up. This would have been pretty long. Fuse came out pretty well. None of the old brakes broke. That's, that's all new brakes. That's not <laughs> none of the old brakes. That's amazing. If you just glue the foam together, it's like the foam breaks before the, you know, wherever you fixed it before with just the glue. I don't use any reinforcements or anything. No carbon rods, no popsicle sticks, no bamboo skewers, no toothpicks. Just a good coat of glue. Umpor foam TAC works well, or TAK. But I've been really liking the Umpor. You can let it sit for probably, um, you know, like 20 minutes and then go back and check your, you know, your fit. And you got about 30 minutes to make, um, repairs now I'm going to start injecting some foam because see I got those cracks there and I just put the this tube of the glue up to it and just squirt it into the cracks that's all I'm doing there just kind of injecting it there you can see me injecting it into the cracks it doesn't really make the hole bigger or anything you know, like sometimes I'll take a popsicle stick and force it down there but I didn't on this there I'm kind of pulling the crack apart make sure I got glue in there now I'm going to inject it from the top just to make sure. And where you, where you screw, where the um, 10 millimeter bolt goes through, that little plastic piece was came up. So I had to pry it up and stick some glue under it too. I almost wanted to, you know, throw this thing out. <laughs> but I said I was going to try to fix it and, you know, I can fix it. I'm through gluing as I'm making this video. I'm just uh, the last thing I did this morning's out there. And the biggest thing is you got to wait between you know between you glue something and let the glue set. Sometimes I let it set for hours before, and then I'll start doing some other pieces. Or sometimes I'll go overnight. It just depends on what else I've got to do. I've been kind of busy getting ready for our trip to Iowa. Looking forward to meeting Mark and maybe try to meet Fred. Fred, email me your phone number, buddy. Just using pins, man. Just sticking the pins in. And there, I kind of had to really press that together here. There, I've got it. I'm holding the piece squeezed in with my thumb. I'm going to stick some pins in it to hold it. My pins have got a little, if I'm having trouble getting the pins out of the cushion, it's because they got a little bit of glue on the on the shaft, which is good for this because it acts like a barb. And I'll clean my pins up before I put them back in the thing. I'll just sit out in the garage and turn the fan on, listen to the Sirius, and or watch the YouTube videos. Now I use some paper tape. I like paper tape because even if it sticks in the glue, you know, it you can pull it out pretty easy. Now I'm going back to the fuse. Or this section of the fuse anyway. I fixed the front earlier in part one, so now I'm going back. Just doing little pieces of it. And you gotta check each piece for further damage. Cause you always get damage. You miss cracks, things you gotta go back and find the cracks and fix it. Uh let's see. Are we okay? Yeah. And I don't know why I didn't take the control surfaces off sooner. Here I'm taking them off now. Then I got I went in and got my ball link pliers and popped them off. Sometimes the ball link pliers work. They don't work too well on these, you know, small cheap um, ball links. But you know, either that or you can get a you get a needle nose pliers and pop them off. Get my pins ready. So I got to put that wing tip on. kind of broke off I think that's right at the end of the carbon fiber where it broke off there all right we're gonna get ready to close this up here before too long um, I want to thank everybody for watching thank you for subscribing and subscribe become part of team let's go flying it doesn't cost you anything if you don't want to watch my videos it'll just drop down I've got like over, around 400 almost 400 subscribers and not everybody puts out videos and those go to the bottom
Now I was worried about getting this straight, and there I'm kind of making sure it's tacky. And I, I take it off like that just to make sure I got enough glue. Then I'm going to use some paper tape. I'm pressing down with my finger so that I'm holding it together. We'll t we'll and I kept checking this. I checked this about every 10 minutes after I got through gluing it. This video is going to get ready to end here. Again, thanks a lot for watching. Thank you for subscribing to become part of Team Let's Go Flying. With Tuco and Jeff and everybody. 900 members. 900 some members. 30 some members. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Thank you. Thank you. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo.